Rolling. Okay. Hi. As you guys already know, my name is Andy, and uh, I'm going to give you a little bit of background about myself and my experience with CAT. Uh, next slide. <clears throat> so my current position is at Donatel. I'm design group team lead. Um, and uh, previous to that, I have worked as an apprentice toolmaker, CNC programmer, and then finally a, a tool designer. I have uh, 10 years of working with CAD Key, which is now uh, known as Key Creator, and then eight years working with a CAM software called SurfCam, and 12 years working with ProEngineer, and finally an additional 12 years working with SolidWorks. Some of those are kind of combined together, but I think you get the idea. I first learned how to draw parametric solid models with the first version of SOLIDWORKS in 1995. And since then I've used every version of SOLIDWORKS commercially uh, produced. And I think I have a very unique situation in which I get to use both softwares, ProEngineer and SOLIDWORKS, on a daily basis. So the purpose of today is uh, what I want to accomplish is prove to you why SOLIDWORKS is a better CAD solution for your company than ProEngineer. So I'm going to give you a little bit of background about SOLIDWORKS. Uh, according to the book, The Design Revolution by Dr. Samuel Miesberg, uh, SOLIDWORKS was the first parametric solid modeling software written for a Windows operating system, whereas ProEngineer was based on Unix. Uh, secondly, there are currently over 10 million SOLIDWORKS licenses in use. It is the most widely known and common CAD software in the industry. And then third, SOLIDWORKS is used by Fortune 500 companies that have thousands of licenses, and then again, much smaller companies that may only have a single license. So it's a good solution for almost everybody. So. Purchasing CAD software is a long-term commitment, and choosing the wrong software can be very costly. Uh, CAD software can be expensive, costing between five and $8,000 per license. And once you have uh, the software in use, you're pretty much committed to it for using it for a long time. CAD files created are not typically, can be opened in a different software, and this is called inoperability. Over a few short years, thousands of files can be created by your company. And these designs is where your technology lies. And it's very important that you have accessible to this information going forward. So companies can actually spend hundreds and thousands of dollars trying to switch CAD systems midstream. So this is why it's important that you choose the right CAD software from the start. So the question is, why choose SOLIDWORKS? Well, I have three main points that I'm ex going to explain to you today. It's easy to learn. Um, SOLIDWORKS is programmed with Visual Basic language. Therefore, it's an open format, and it works very well with many common programs. And then SOLIDWORKS Sketcher is very powerful and easy to use. So let's dig in a little bit deeper on the first point. Uh, SOLIDWORKS is easy to learn, and uh, most people that have never even experienced CAD before can be drawing simple models with little or no training. Uh, as an example, there are many useful tutorials online that are, right that are available right inside the program. On the left-hand side of the program, there is a snap open window that is directly connected to the SOLIDWORKS online help. Um, number two, SOLIDWORKS as easy to recognize icons for creating features, unlike ProEngineer that still has menu-driven structure for a lot of common functions, like their drawing mode. And then third, uh, SOLIDWORKS is so easy to learn that someone with no experience at all can learn the basics in a very short time. A uh, personal example of this is my son needed to draw a diagram for a school project. He was about 11 years old at the time. So what I said to him, I said, well, let's see, you know, see if you can do this in SOLIDWORKS because I think it will work pretty well. Well, I worked with him for about 30 minutes, 
and uh, in a very short period of time, he was able to do it himself, and he was able to create the diagram that he needed for his uh, project, school project. The second reason to choose SOLIDWORKS over ProEngineer is it's compatible with other programs. SOLIDWORKS is written in Visual Basics programming language and designed to run on a Windows operating system, so it is compatible with a lot of other programs. Once you're familiar with the basics of Windows programming, it's much easier to create and change assemblies than any other CAD software, such as ProEngineer, that was written for a Unix operating system. Um, when you actually open up a drawing table inside SolidWorks, it's actually accessing Microsoft Excel table, unlike ProEngineer, which has a very cryptic table program. And then, uh, finally, there are countless third-party applications written for SolidWorks like eDrawings and Inspection Expert. Because of the open programming language, it's very easy for other companies to develop apps for SolidWorks that enhance the pro productivity. From my own personal experience using SolidWorks, uh, when using SolidWorks, being able to use a program that I'm familiar with, like uh, the Excel table for creating uh, drawing bill of materials, you know, it's a huge time saver. The third reason to choose SOLIDWORKS over ProEngineer is their 2D sketcher is second to none. The most basic function for 2D to modeling is creating a sketch. The sketch is the beginning step of every solid model. A designer spends more time in sketch mode than any of the other solid modeling functions. Well, in SOLIDWORKS, a sketcher, you can create sketches that are considered unconstrained, meaning that the constraints such as vertical, horizontal, and dimensions can be applied after the fact. Unlike ProEngineer, that requires you, your sketches to be fully defined before a prismatic extrude or evolve can be made. Once you have your basic sketch created, you can create smart dimensions for your sketch. Intuitively, these dimensions can be created for horizontal, vertical, angular, these dimensions are very easy to create and manipulate inside SOLIDWORKS. The third useful tool inside SOLIDWORKS Sketcher is the Lineal Sketch Patterns. This is where you can create a horizontal or vertical pattern of a shape like a circle inside the sketch mode very easily. ProEngineer does not offer this type of functionality inside their Sketcher program. A Sketcher tool like this can save you a lot of time. I personally prefer to use SOLIDWORKS over ProEngineer to develop concept ideas because it's much faster. The ability to throw down a sketch and not have to worry about constraints allows me to develop my concepts a lot faster. In conclusion, you should choose SOLIDWORKS as your CAD software because it's easy to learn, compatible with other programs, and its 2D sketcher is second to none. Thank you.